Hi friends. We all have a sticky menu at our WordPress websites. So uh, we don't need to discuss more on the sticky menu. However, uh, it is a very good feature. If you are wondering how you can add floating menu in the left side of page or right side of page or at the bottom of the page that is more interactive to users and how easily you can actually do this so this video is exactly for you in this in the order to enhance the feature of wordpress i have a great option for adding floating menu on the different section of the page and i am going to use a wonderful plugin for this uh, wp floating menu pro and this is one page navigator sticky menu for wordpress and all so it is well available on the code canyon i'm going to add a link where you can get this plugin in the description of this video and uh, the plugin is very effective and i'll show you the live example so you have many options so you can choose uh, ready-made templates uh, for uh, using the menu in any style so you can see on the right side left side and with details and uh, pages can be added so anywhere on the page so it is working very fine so like different options are here like you can add home or you can add in the uh, right panel and all so you have multiple options and i'll show you how it is working so this is an example in the left side of page so it is working very fine and this is another example it is more interactive and useful and it is on the back bottom of the page and another is on both side of the page okay so we are going to explore this option at our demo website this is our demo website and i'm going to add a plugin here and i have already plugin so i'm going to add this plugin directly okay so okay so i'm going to add a new plugin that is uh, this is the plugin so wp floating menu pro and i'm going to add this uh, upload plugin choose file and this is the plugin zip file so i'm installing this let us see how it works and uh, how easy to configure it is really so i'm also installing very first time so i'm exploring along with the you on this screen only and okay so let us activate the plugin okay so it has been activated and okay so simple share buttons google maps where it is where is the plugin oh it is amazing okay so it is here uh, so and uh, by access press themes uh, it has been developed by the access keys and they are really good i believe and okay so we can check uh, where we can go for setting settings so simple share button reading okay so this is the setting okay okay so we have options and we can add new plugins so um, add new menu custom templates floating menu setting how to use so how to use guide is also here so we can take a look here and menu i can type okay so these are various options and all menu we can add new menu directly let us see how it works so on pages so we can have on pages so uh, we can keep the menu name taste one add menu and okay so display setting is here it is great and this is the template so menu after scroll event so many scroll after and build so this is the template okay so there are multiple temp 20 templates i have built a template and i'll select a template like template 2 template 3 okay it is really good 4 so i'll use this template 3 option you can choose any so there are many 20 templates are available at this and see here so there are various options as we seen in the demo of the website so these are the options so we have 
multiple options of course and we can customize the plugin as we need so i'm just simply selecting this uh, top left can be good top right uh, no uh, middle right middle right can be good for me so many after so i am just saving this menu and i am going to add some uh, create new menu or keep current menu okay so menu name is here i believe one menu is here display setting we have already done and i believe we have created a new menu so we can check in the menu section and no it is not here okay so as i said i am also exploring with you so this is the test one and we can edit and uh, pages we can okay so we have to add pages and we can add add to menu okay that is very simple and we can add custom links as well and we can add categories so this is good and we have all the option where what we wish to add i'm just exploring the option and now i believe it should work it, it should be here on the page okay nothing is here Let's see. we have saved the menu display setting save menu and preview menu okay so it is here we can go back to the home page why it is not visible directly okay so menu is not being displayed so I just explored and another setting available I it is my my fault so you know, floating menu setting is available here and we have to enable or disable all the settings from here on this screen and now i have selected where and which menu is to be displayed so we have a very comprehensive setting here and we can actually uh, control overall the display of menu from this screen that is available on the uh, floating menu setting and it is the guide is available in how to use so you can explore uh, that guide as well but it is very simple so we have to enable or disable menu so uh, we can simply enable the menu here and enable disable all menu for desktop screen it is uh, in control if checked menu will be disabled for the screen size more than 10 24 pixels and for mobile screen you can enable disable and responsive screen you can enable it. and you can decide where and which menu is to be displayed like we have created test one menu here and we have uh, enabled the uh, test one at desktop and responsive at screen so similarly you can create multiple menu and we, we you can decide where these menus uh, is to be displayed and again further um, there is a setting um, menu so high setting heading so so all on pages home page only or so on a specific page if we select so on a specific page we can decide uh, uh, where that particular menu is to be displayed it is very very uh, good setting so if just in case if we want to show any particular menu on the uh, certain section of the page right like bottom left top left uh, and on a certain page only so we can create a menu and we can decide which menu is to be displayed so it is very very useful setting so i have seen in multiple cases that we need to uh, show certain information on a single page only so we a single or multiple page wherever uh, so mm. we have this option to show the menu wherever we want and in, this is why i have selected this plugin to be on this channel so it is going to be very useful just in case if you are looking for this option now we have uh, enabled the option and you can refresh the page okay so it is here 
so we further need to check okay so it is working fine and we need to uh, customize this menu buttons and all so since we have added the pages directly so it is showing like points so I, we have other options like and we can choose another templates and the menu settings so i'll show you again uh, all menus yes we can select here and i can simply edit this one so we have chosen template so icons we can uh, definitely icons can be there so just in case if you are uh, using uh, the cart options and also like built-in template is here and we can use custom template to so custom templates and we can create custom templates as well and i'll show you this is the custom template option and we can simply create a new custom template here and we can select menu layout template one and we can keep the name of custom template and icon background color icon size I icon hover font color font size and everything can be customized here so we can add custom template I'm not going to show you all these things so it is very simple to handle um, whatever you want through this plugin so you can create a custom template and you can add menu as I shown and in the uh, beginning of this video so just keep in mind you have to make this setting very carefully so that wherever you want to show the menu you can you'll be able to show the menu there and i believe this uh, floating menu pro uh, option is really going to be helpful for you so wherever you want you can show the menu and again so what i'll do i'll make a change just to check everything is working fine and i will go to the more options and edit here and display settings so built-in template i'm using i'm going to do this one okay so if it is working go to home page and top left so i'm going to uh, bottom right bottom center so i'm going to add this side by all center let us see what happens if it is really good okay so it is here it is here but yes so option is uh, we have not set adequately so this is why uh, it is it is here but uh, we we are unable to see uh, just a minute we can change another template because it is in white color so it is not visible what we can do uh, okay so i'll choose another one this can be good and i'll refresh the page okay so it is here and we just need to configure the uh, colors and all it will definitely work so I believe this is going to be uh, helpful for you and you can get this plugin through the link given in the description through the code that is available in the, on the code canyon as well. So let us meet in another video in which I am going to bring another functionality for you. Thank you.